Rallycross is basically the best combination between rally and racing. You need to be quick, strategic, be good at overtakes and the launch moments. It's basically the best, I say, mix of everything that contains speed. It's a bold move to go for the electric. We've now transformed the combustion FIA World Rallycross Championship into an electric Rallycross Championship. So there's no way back. There is the old sport, if you want to say, so it doesn't exist anymore. It is really a natural development to go from combustion to electric um, to follow a sustainable path. And the cars are quicker. Uh, the cars have 680 horsepowers um, and they go from 0 to 100 in 1.8 seconds, which is actually much, much faster um, than a Formula One car and faster than the old combustion cars. To see the difference in the electric rallycross cars is it's kind of huge in one sense because of the instant torque and all the power that you have in the car. So it's, it's quite different, but at the same time, it's a car with four wheels that you need to go quick. It's a, it's a natural way for a sport to go and also I think rallycross suits the electrification really well because it is like short action-packed races. You, you need the full battery and the full power but only for five laps. Of course change is uh, it's a big thing and it will take some time for everyone to adapt for it but I think they have so much potential to be the, the quickest rallycross car ever built in my opinion. This is not your everyday driving. This is something completely different. That's evolution. That's not doing something because you have to. It's the right thing to do and it's the fast thing to do. And I think that, that, that really makes a big difference. Uh, I'm a former ski racer, downhill racer. And when it comes to the glaciers, I mean, you see them melting away. It's a sad story because right now there are two glaciers in Norway. And I think there's no glaciers in Europe that have skiing right now. And then you realize something needs to be done because we all need to change but the problem is if we have to change for something that isn't as fun or exciting or you know as good for your everyday life even it's hard to get masses to change i think um, the, the crowd will really recognize the performance of an electric car and then you'll have less of the people that say oh everything was better before it was louder and more exciting and you'll have more of the believers in not just the sustainability aspect, but actually the performance aspect. I'm only 22 years old and this has been my dream for as long as I can remember. And to see this change happen already is very inspiring. We need to not only look at like what we love, which is motorsport, but also look at what the world we're living in and what's happening there. And you see that everything is going more sustainable. It's a whole new chapter. I think I would be inspired as a, as a young kid seeing these, these beasts out on the track. that we can be kind of role model for other motorsports. We need to see what comes. I mean, there are other technologies out there like hybrid or hydrogen. Um, let's, let's see what the future brings. But uh, I think there is more to come in motorsport. <laughs> <laughs>